Okay, we are, uh, we're live and we're doing this tonight. We're doing this tonight because I feel like, it. and that's, that's the long and short. Ooh, ooh, we're getting right into it. Stubborn bastard. Hey, hey, hey! And how the heck is he keeping up with such a huge sword? It's going too fast for me to say it all. Damn, we can't shake him! We have no choice. Time to counterattack. I guess you're finally taking me seriously. Good. I was getting sick of playing tag with you fools. He's not gonna give up until he's dead. What a stubborn idiot. Does he really think he can beat us two on one? <laughs> I already have. Every fight takes spirit. You'll lose that. You'll lose everything. I'm not sure that's how it works again. And I gotta be honest, I don't think you can take them two on one. I mean, like, in terms of sheer DPS, you probably have them beat. But... I think they can whittle you down. Damn it. We can't get caught now. <laughs> okay. How about you just surrender and give me your full confessions? Starting with who you are and what you're after. You needn't concern yourself with that. What? Oh, it's you. Commander. Hmm. You two are pitiful. You failed to report in as appointed, and this is why. We have no excuses. We had a lot of interference. I get it. So you're the man in charge, eh? <laughs> Only of this particular scene. Allow me to apologize on behalf of my men. Could I persuade you to overlook this incident? I said that I'd like for you to overlook this incident. We never had any intention of running afoul with the Bracers Guild. Don't make me laugh! You think I'm just gonna let, look the other way and let you get away with it? Ah, well, I had thought it a generous offer personally. Certainly fair a price than death. Both of you, stand down. Return to the Renovance point at once. Um, the Renovance point, presumably. Fine. My target may have changed, but as long as I have one. And you being the leader, I assume you've got better information anyway. <laughs> you think it'll... Uh, you think it'll be that easy to make me talk? Yeah, let's find out. Ooh. Oh, that's fancy. Also, new music. Hmm, not bad. Not bad at all. I cannot help but notice that this guy's sword is nearly as large as a gate. You have an irrepressible irre passion, but a w great weight bears down upon you. You are not quite so different from me. What did you just say? It's a painful thing to be powerless in a time of crisis. But you know that feeling all too well, don't you? I can see it in your eyes. <laughs> Fine then. I don't know who you are, but I think I like you. There's no shame in power powerlessness. 
There's no shame in being outmatched. You and I both know that. Perhaps we could come to a mutually beneficial agreement. Screw you! Don't act like you know anything about me. You're in for one hell of a beatdown. All talk and no shock. Bet the guild's gonna love interrogating you. Uh oh. What the? Um. But. What? <laughs> I can't sense something faint from the dark forest beyond. <laughs> Nice try, but you've got a heavy heart. And a heavy heart makes for a light blade. Why don't you come out from hiding and say that again? When a warrior enters a scrimmage, he must be prepared to lose everything. Otherwise, he can gain nothing. In order to live as a man, you must forgo all anger and grief. With that, I bid you farewell. The presence has vanished. Hmm. What is it that eats at a gate's heart? The Black Orbment. Chapter 3 Guess she's not here yet Did we get here that early? Could be Want to kill some time in the tavern? I doubt I could get tired of the view of the river. <laughs> no kidding. As someone who lives near a large river myself, I have got to agree. Watching the river is can be a great can be a great view. Well, a student mayor has never been arrested before. Try to imagine if Major Clop Major Mayor Cross was arrested in Rowan. Yeah, that would be a real shock. But when I think of it that way, the people of Rowan almost seem cold. I mean, they were clearly surprised by what happened, but not a single person was truly shocked. Well, you have to remember, the mayor of Rouen has always been selected by Bloodline alone. He wasn't elected to his position by Rouenians, and that probably makes all the difference in the world. That's true. The people of Roland appointed Mayor Kloss because they liked him and trusted him. Delmore is getting what he deserves, but I still feel kind of bad for him. It's the burb! And presumably Chloe as well. There she is. I'm sorry <sighs> that I'm late. No problem. We just got here ourselves. Don't tell us you ran all the way here. You really didn't have to rush. I couldn't let you two go off without seeing you off. Thank you very much for contacting me. Well, we, I keep telling you, you don't have to thank us. You two see, thanks for coming. 
Well, then shall we be off? Okay. We need to use the south exit to reach the right? Yes. On the southern road is a checkpoint called Air Legend. You can set out for Zeus from there. Roger that. Okay, let's go. Um, later. I got other things I want to do. Like, I want to check in the Bracey's Guild to see if there's any new jobs. There are not. And I want to talk to everyone. Are you planning to go to Zeus next? There are many clues about the Black Ordinate there. It's, it'll be a real load off our minds when you two get promoted. Okay. I wasn't sure, so I wanted to double check. Oh, hey you guys. Pertha? Are you feeling better? Fit as a fiddle. I'm back at work as of today. I wish I had some way to pay you back for all the trouble I put you through. Oh, come on. Once you become full fresh bracers, come back to Rouen. I'll be waiting for you. The mayor has been arrested. I just don't... What's going on? Well, you see, the mayor was a bad, bad man who was probably under mind control. Or hypnosis, or... Look, just stuff happened. Does something happen to the mayor, I wonder? Mm-hmm. I never have suspected the mayor done more of such crimes. The position of mayor in Rouen has been held by the Dalmores for generations. I suspect that one of them being arrested will be the end of that little tradition. For an old man like me, it's been a genuine shock. Hmm. Wait. Aha! Rampage of Incumbent Mayor. Motive brought to light. We'll take a look through that a little later on. And since we're here, all this talk of the mayor doing these terrible things is quite unsettling. Even so, it's a good thing that he was arrested. Someone like that would no doubt only get into more trouble if he were allowed. Thank you! Is there someone over here? There is not. I've been invited to Zeus as a guest engineer. But in the end, I turned down the invitation. It was very flattering to me as an engineer, but I'm Todd's brother first and foremost. I have my own reasons for not wanting to leave the land. If not for me, my brother would probably be researching new kinds of engines. Um, I feel bad for them, but I think they'll be fine. We care about each other, so we try to take care of each other. It's not always easy, that's for sure. Okay, where to next? Uh, probably over here. It is heartbreaking that children should be drawn to such terrible events. The head of our church is planning to visit the children. I intend to go with him, if he'll allow me. I so the love of money claimed the mayor, as it has done with many others. Care must be taken to ensure that the region does not fall into chaos and disorder. Almighty Ideas, please grant us your guidance and wisdom. Th 
This whole mess with the mayor has caused quite a stir. It's making it difficult to study with all the noise. It's just amazing to me that Mayor Delmore was responsible for all this trouble. I'd always thought him a good man, but boy was I wrong. I wonder what our dads were making so much noise about. Um, well. Given that the mayor was the face of Ruin's tourism industry, his arrest will really ruin the town's image. We're already seeing a drop in the number of visitors and reservations. If we really have to elect a new mayor, I'd prefer it to be Mr. Norman. I think he'd do a lot to help build up the tourism industry. Um, preferably without, you know... Yeah. I think my mom and dad are both home today. I hope I'll get to play. No one down there. If you've got a smile on your face all your life, it kind of loses meaning. But the fact is, we're alive. I'm relieved to know that the mayor's been arrested. Since Hustel Moore is no, has no more heirs, we'll have to elect a new mayor, won't we? Actually, um... Anything in here I don't have? Is it true what the Liberal News wrote? It's just so hard to believe that the mayor was a criminal. Although, I never really liked him all that much either. The mayor did something bad? He's not a nice man? Nope. I think I'll go to Z Zeiss for some fishing next. I've never been there before, but I hear it's a fisherman's dream. I did it. I figured out the map. Okay, this time I'm gonna find that pirate treasure. The Ravens must have been hypnotized by the mayor to help him or something. To tell the truth, my little brother is one of them. He doesn't always do the right thing, but he's not a bad person. Idiots. I guess now's the time to pay the piper. Hard to believe that the mayor's been arrested. I suppose this means we'll be electing a new mayor. I'll be extremely interested to see who decides to run. That could be interesting. Because, like, I am, like, 95% sure that Liberal has mayors for life. So... Electing the mayor is not necessarily something that happens all that often. And even trying to run could say a lot about a person. Oops. The arrest of the mayor is going to cause some big trouble for government proceedings. I figure it'll also have a big impact on tourism. One up here. And no one in here. Okay. Where to next? Um probably let me think here. I think I'll go to the village next. Then I'll work my way back from there. <sighs> Let's 
see. I need to go down here. Right here. Briefly. And around. And back up. Fortunately, there's no monsters in the way. Not really. Excuse me. Um, here we are. Let's go to the other end of the village, and then here too we will work- Okay, I guess these people are still here. I wonder if they started construction yet. Now where'd Zack run off to this time? I was hoping to get him to go to ruin with me. Whether one can believe it or not, what puzzles me most is why he would do such things. Oh my, Estelle, are you leaving? Yep, we gotta go to Zeiss, actually. Oh, I see. Well, we're all greatly indebted to, to you for all you've done. It pains me that I cannot repay your kindness. Please, it's really fine. I'm really just glad that all those kids are happy again. Yep, all those kids lined up in front of Joshua. Um, <laughs> I wonder what's going on there. Um, hmm, Joshua, do you need to explain something? I'm so relieved that the Matron is here. I know I have to learn to be more grown up, though. And someday... <sighs> Excuse me. We can repay the matron back for all she's done for us. It's no fun to play when Paul... What? Oh, they're playing tag? No, I already... Yeah, they're... Hmm. No one's out here, or over there. I'm in shock that the mayor was involved in those crimes. Well, at least the matron will get some kind of reparations if proof can be established. If the orphanage gets built, I'd be glad to help. I can hear the kids' voices from here. Adios be praised. I'm not surprised that Stuart uh, Gilbert is a criminal. But even so, it's hard to believe that the mayor would be involved in something that terrible. I guess he'll have to, the rest of his life to pay for what he's done. Hmm. Too much snow in the southern face for it to be safe. I guess we'll have to plan a new route. Alright, time to get back to climbing. The peak of Crone is calling to me. The peaks are, rather. I asked everyone from the orphanage to stay here until they can rebuild. We've had a good bit of fun. The kids finally seem happy again. I'm still having a tough time dealing with Mayor Del Moore being a criminal, though. There's no telling what the kids will think once they figure it all out. My back's been feeling better ever since the children came. Maybe some of their energies are rubbing off on me. That's kind of a sweet thought. Okay. Next stop is the orphanage. 
where there may be someone or there may not be. Um, it turns out it is the latter. Okay, um, next will be the school, which I kind of neglected the last time I was going back and forth. Be well, look, I just didn't want to run down the big road. Look, let's be real, that's the reason I didn't go to the school. Also, the gate might be closed. I'm not sure. But I didn't bother to check the gate because I didn't want to run down the pathway. And that's on me. But we're going to do it now. You know what? Actually, I bet that I missed a book or something for not going there. I've missed several books at this point, so it definitely seems possible. Oh, I almost hit that one. I almost hit some baby melon boys. Or whatever they are. I mean, they look like watermelons, but boar, but pigs, so yeah. Melon boys. Gate is open, that means I probably could have come back here earlier as well, but I didn't. Oh well. Gym class just finished up. You need more than studying to succeed in life. It also takes physical fitness. A beautiful body complements a beautiful mind. A few of my classes will put you on the right track for that. One more day finished. So what to do next? We're working on art class assignments. We just came back here to get some supplies. Now that we forgot them, we, uh, we just needed more. You forgot them. Well, hey, everyone forgets a few things from time to time. <laughs> if you don't hurry, activities, time will be over. for so long that it's difficult to contain my shock at what he's been doing. It's not so much his crimes that are unforgivable, but I think he, he might be too. I pray that he will come to regret spring from the past. I've been put in charge of writing up the entrance examinations for this year. I look forward to the challenge. Class may be over, but I still get questions from my students. I don't really understand the lesson of my last class. Finally, classes are done! Afternoon classes always make me nap. Okay. Aw oh, man, I wanted to ask Miss Milia about the stuff I didn't understand. 
But she always leaves the classroom in such a hurry. I never get the chance. Whoops. All right, done with class. Time to go for club activities. Uh, lounge around at home club. Okay, yeah, that sounds... I definitely did that in high school. Uh, <laughs> is all I'll say on that matter. Here, Miss Wyo... Weola? Miss W. How'd you do it? She doesn't know either. No. Rumor has it that the Queen's birthday celebration is going to feature the biggest celebration yet. I'd love for my fencing club to participate. Hmm. Today's lesson was very worthwhile. I think I can safely skip the school door. Like, the old door, I mean. Mm-hmm. Since there shouldn't be any students back there in the first place. Ah, It's finally over. I think I'm gonna go home and get some rest. There, what can I do for you? Genus sandwich. Right there. Genus lunch. Three Wow, that is a very expensive lunch. I don't think I would even save any time to money but uh by buying the wrong ingredients. Certainly not much, at least. Let's see, maybe around here? I'm looking for stuff to help me write with the novel I'm writing. I, all the books I've been reading lately have really inspired me to write something of my own. Here, take a look at this one. I found it really moving. Same to be honest? Uh, okay. Let's see. Where are we on books? Okay, we have missed chapters 3 and 5 for Carnelia. I have Liberal News issue 6 though. Not issue 1, but I read issue 1 before, so I think it still counts. Okay, I, I gotta be honest, I'm not gonna read the Camellias anymore, the Carnelias anymore. It's too broken up because I've missed too many chapters. But I will read this. After I'm done with the school. Which, uh, you know, I almost am. Hey, Estelle and Joshua. Did you guys come here especially for me? It hasn't been so long, but then there's been lots going on, both good and bad. It sure is good to see you two. Once everything really settles down, we can all focus on our futures. I hope you have fun when you go to Zeus. Well, if it isn't Joshua, I'm Estelle. I read the liberal news about Mayor Delmore and his dirty little schemes. I guess that's why he acted all innocent and benevolent when he gave his donation at the festival. And he was even more nasty uh, to attack the matron afterwards. He must really be brought to the core. Okay, so I do not think that the mayor is a good person, but I do think he was brainwashed to be worse than he otherwise would have been. The plants are getting overgrown. I'll have to prune them back soon. <laughs> I wish even evening would come sooner. I found the dark very soothing. I especially like taking baths. In absolute pitch black. Hmm, maybe I will try that. Christmas is coming up, I should have some time to myself. So, so, 
I think not absolute pitch black, though. I think that would be rather fright... frightening. But you know, like, get some candles going. In my experience, reviewing the class and lesson really makes a difference. I review for three hours and do prep work for another two. Every you spend five hours doing review? That is not healthy. And it does not teach you to be a good student. That sort of repetitive path uh, approach is only really useful for... Well, actually, I guess to be fair, it's probably useful for learning to build up endurance. But I feel quite certain that there are better and more effective ways to do that. Most, mostly, it's a case, instead of even building up endurance, it's more a case of if you don't have the endurance already, you'll never make it through all that. It's more like, um, that sort of repetitiveness is okay for route learning, that is memorization. But it is pretty much rubbish for anything else. I have strong opinions on the place of route memorization in our schooling systems, and uh, well, let's just say that I'm not a fan. Okay, well, we're back in Rouen, so now seems like a good time to read the liberal news. After I take a sip of tea. <clears throat> a sudden arrest. Yesterday afternoon, Ruins Mayor Morris Delmore, 48, was arrested by the Royal Guards in suspicion of arson and intent to commit other crimes. His steward, Gilbert Stein, was arrested on the same day. Charges. Time. Both are in custody of the Intelligence Division and have been transferred to Leyston Fortress. A horrifying rampage by the incumbent mayor. Mayor Del Moore is suspected of ordering arson carried out by on the Mercia Orphanage and plotting the theft of the donations as well. <coughs> That's not really working. Um, although those responsible for committing the acts have not yet been caught, the mayor, Stuart Gilbert, was seized at the scene, suggesting his involvement. Uh, Arsili's aid in arrest. Mayor Delmore abruptly fled his residence during questioning by the Racer Guild and attempted to flee down the Rub Robine River in his personal yacht. Racers reacted quickly and alerted the Royal Guard, who rushed to the scene in the high-speed cruiser, Arsili, and used his hall as a barrier to the escape. After his apprehension, after his apprehension, the suspect appeared to have temporarily lapsed of memory, possibly due to shock, but has since gained his composure. Regain. What motivated such a despicable act? A figure born into privilege and wealth who, for years, managed the affairs of the municipal government, has fallen from grace. All for what in the end seems nothing more than an enormous debt, born from insatiable personal greed. In an investigation conducted by the Liberal News, it was uncovered that Morris Del Moore had been engaged in a number of speculative market transactions. However, a year prior, these deals in the Republic fell through, and he was left with a substantial debt. In order to overcome these losses, Delmore diverted money from the city's budget and attempted to develop a number of resort homes to be built somewhere within the region, perhaps reasoning that the profit gained from some prime real estate would hide his pilfering from the city coffers and restore his prior wealth. Unfortunately, to the key to his plan, Mercia Orphanage declined and offered to sell the land upon which it stood. The desperate suspect then resorted to arson and slipped into a heinous spree of crime. 
With the incumbent mayor under arrest and incapable of fulfilling his duties, Ruan's succeeding municipal government is expected to endure an extended period of confusion. However, through the abolishment of the aristocracy and simultaneous enactment of royal charter, in an instance such as this one, the law stipulates that an election must be held at the earliest possible date, and a new mayor selected. Therefore, it is in the interest of public stability, a prompt and non-partisan election is awaited by all. Ugh. Okay, the orbital calculator. Mechanical computation through the application of ornaments has been used in a vast range of fields, beginning with naval navigational equipment aboard airships. However, the chapel, which is located in Zeiss, the capital rather? I don't know. Which is located in Zeiss Central Factory, reigns supreme on this department. The capital has the ability to instantly locate information from within its databanks, which currently store an amount equal to that of numerous encyclopedias. The capital's inventor, Professor Russell, is presently researching further possible applications for this technology. It's a... It's an orbital computer, which seems interesting. Oof, that took a little bit out of me. Um... Mm -hmm. That would make sense. It's hard not to look at Chief Portos and not feel a little sorry for how stressed the old man is out all the time. Mayor Del Moore took tourism way too seriously. I knew he'd never buy replacements for our equipment. A real mayor would do what's best for his citizens, not what makes him the most money. If the boss got elected as mayor, it makes things a lot less stressful on us. It's hard to believe what the mayor let himself become. And I'd been hoping to discuss the condition of the harbor's equipment with him. Hmm, so now what do we do? Run for mayor, I guess. The mayor, arrested. Don't care how much money you've got or who you are. If you start attacking orphans, you're scum. I find it hard to disagree with that sentiment. It's a nasty story to shock the phallus of scoundrels. Mm-hmm. I would say it was fairly major, yes. Uh, the guy in the North Block wanted Norman to be the new mayor. We'd rather be Portos. I'll be off at sea, so I won't get a chance to vote. Whoever the next mayor is, I hope he'll keep the dock hands and sailors in mind. I mean, there is such a thing as a absentee ballot, but, you know, I let's not go there. Let's not worry about it. Although in real life, definitely worry about it. Most places, many places have absentee ballots, and it's usually pretty easy to enter. L look it up in your local jurisdiction. But, um... In the context of this fantasy game, we're not going to worry about it. The Ravens! Mm -hmm. about this, he's going to start hitting us again. I don't think my head can take any more trauma. If they sp spot you, you'll get locked up in the naval airship. This girl in blue and white uniform told me so. Hmm. A 
I could have sworn that Gilbert was coming here. We can't remember a damn thing about this whole to-do. have ever been elected as mayor before. But the next election will change all of that, unpleasant though it may be. I guess that if anyone else wants to be mayor, now is the time to get, try. I wish my husband had a little more drive. I've been working here for a long time, but what should I do about my pay? <laughs> that is a very important question. Who would believe that the mayor would be arrested? What's to become of this estate now? I've gotten wrapped up in this whole mess. I think that Dario and I are going to leave soon and go find new jobs. Maybe I should become a guide? Hmm. I wonder how much of this alone might have been worth. I always thought the mayor to be a fine man, and I was proud to prepare his meals. We've come to a sorry state, more's the pity. Oh, hello! We are just finishing up exploring around... Well, here. Then we can head to the next area. Is there anything back here? Mm. Not really, is there? Oh! A drawbridge control unit. That's what this is. I was wondering. Okay, yep. Uh, I think with that we are done and maybe actually there might be one more house left before we are done in Yuan. But we really close. What ha what's happened is truly a shame, but we can't afford to sit and puzzle over it. The mayor made a grave mistake, but he's the reason that Ruin's been so successful in its expansion. Hmm. My brother hasn't come home yet, and Dad said he's not welcome here. What? Um. I'm in shock that the mayor was involved in such a horrible scandal! And I thought him to be such a fine man when I spoke to him. Okay. To our next destination. Which should be somewhere over here. Somewhere. Okay. Wait, but what's Wait, 
what? It's the, this is south. I guess it is. Hmm. But this is a nice little spot. The view here is breathtaking. It certainly doesn't feel like a checkpoint, that's for sure. Actually, I hear a lot of visitors come here to see the waterfall. Really? Ruin sure has a lot of nice places. I can understand why the Duke would want to live here. But I think Roland is also a nice relaxing place to live. You've been to Roland? Yes, I've been to all the great cities. Oh, that's right. Zeiss is up ahead. There's five great cities. How many have I been to? Um, one, two... Zeiss will be number four. I'm gonna guess number five is the capital, so chapter four will probably be in the capital. You'll be surprised at how charming it is. Really? Sounds like we're in for some fun. Alright, why don't we get the paperwork started then? Anyone at- Nope! Welcome to Air Eleven. If you want to get set up to go through, head to the counter inside. Good afternoon. How may I be of assistance? We were wondering what had to be done to obtain permission to enter Zeiss. Ah, okay then. Step right up. I'll take care of you. Be aware though, once these procedures have begun, you will not be allowed to leave the checkpoint. Are you okay with that? Go ahead, please. Then please start by signing these documents. All right, everything looks to be in order. If is the young lady there not joining you? Oh, I only came to see them all. Very well then. You'll be able to accompany them as far as the mouth of the tunnel. Thank you very much. What's the Caldia Tunnel? It's the main road that joins this checkpoint to Zeiss. The path is a long tunnel that passes directly under through Caldia Hill. That's ve that's pretty neat. And and fantastical. <laughs> that's a pretty sight. So the waterfall comes from a man-made river. I think it's called the... I'm not even going to try to pronounce that. It was made a very long time ago. It's linked directly to the Valeria Lakeshore. Pretty impressive, given that they did it all without any orphans. The entrance to the tunnel. So I guess this is goodbye. Yes. So you're going to be traveling around the kingdom, right? We might be able to meet up again in Grenzel. Really? I'll be going back there when the Queen's birthday celebration starts. Some of my relatives will be there, so I have to join them. That's just a month away, isn't it? I think we may actually be in Grenzel by then. So then, once you're done with your family stuff, contact the Grenzel Guild branch. If you do, we can try to meet up. I certainly will. Estelle and Joshua, I 
can't thank you enough. I won't ever forget that you what the everything you've done for me. Come on, don't be so formal. We're in your debt as well for many reasons. I'd say we're pretty even. What a thing to say. When when your friend is still there, I said some terrible things. You care for no one but yourself? But I was no different. I've been running away from the reality of my own situation for a while now. The orphanage and the academy. But the two of you taught me something. You helped me find the courage to hold my head high. And find the strength to protect what matters. Because of you, I know how to be brave. I don't really get it, but if we were able to help, I'm happy. Cheer up, okay? We'll see each other again in Grantsville. Yes, absolutely. Any bird you know. I think he'll be there. Sieg is just full of surprises, isn't he? Well then, shall we be off? Good luck to both of you on your journey. And I'll be praying for you to find your father. Thank you. You two take care. Sorry to keep you waiting, Chloe. Miss Julia, you're done with your duties at L Liston Fortress? Yes. It took longer than I had anticipated. Pardon my rudeness, but I've come to get your report on the incident. Thank you for your service. <laughs> hey now, settle down, C. Have you been fulfilling your duty as escort? Okay, I am now convinced that Chloe is a royal. He's always been very helpful. Isn't that right, C? He's certainly chipper. The Arcelius is stopped at the end of the highway. You are to report there. Understood. I'll be leaving school for a while. I need to say goodbye to my teachers before returning to Grantsel. 